Uh, so, uh, very nice. <laughs> uh, I've been planning this for several months, but um, I haven't streamed in a very long time, so we're gonna see how this works. Uh, so, I was gonna start out with going over everything that I've been working on to show y'all. Uh, 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 hello. If you can't tell, I'm very, very, very nervous. <laughs> uh, I just started moving the archive again a couple weeks ago. Yeah, I'm glad the model is working. Ada did a really good job. Yeah, it's not so smooth so far. Um, so, if you want to start the presentation, that's what I'm going to start with. everything I made myself and um, yeah so I'm gonna start this presentation yeah you like the stinger I got it uh, made but uh, in the future I might want to make a new one So let's start off with who I am and where you are. <laughs> uh, you just entered my archive and we'll go over how that came into existence later. later. Uh, so my name is Ailsong. I am considered a brewer and basically what that is is I used to be a enforcement, carbon enforcement unit on my old world, and it mainly dealt with like alchemy um, and trying to control people who were experimenting uh, in, in inhumanely. So yeah, that's. So my title, it's Brewer is my title. Not my old world, we didn't really have like family names, so yeah, it's just Ale Song. Uh my clan. So it's uh Fulgans. It's just a uh, basically on your world, it's a red panda. But and when I'm when I uh, entered the archive, I kind of changed to look more. I've been having internet hiccups, so let's see. It says I'm still online. tell me if I'm back. It still says I'm here. Oh, then that might be Twitch. Not me. But am I here now, Sakura? Uh, 
Okay. Cool. Can you hear me? Okay, cool. I'm back. Yay! Okay. So my birthday is November 28th, and yeah, it just passed. Uh, I didn't really get to do much this year. I had wanted to debut before my birthday, but uh, just a lot of life stuff happened. And yes, I love the fall. It's my favorite time of year. Thank you. I'm an old lady. <laughs> uh, I like the cooler weather and stuff. Uh, I used to be from a very hot place and the fall was the only like good time of year where I could uh, get um, like a brief period of relaxation. <laughs> yeah. And then uh, my height, I'm about 162 centimeters. So I think in your freedom units, that's 5'4". I'd be four inches. Yeah, I'm kind of on the shorter side, but it's all right. Uh, when I was an enforcer, being low to the ground was better because you can avoid like chemical chemical fumes and stuff a lot. And then also, uh, I'm mostly a brawler type, so I like being stuck. I did injure myself though near my in the right before coming into the archive and I couldn't practice martial arts as much anymore. <laughs> Short nation. <laughs> yeah, I'm barely under what you would consider for like a uh, short people day where you can kick tall people in the shins. <laughs> Over 5'5". Five five. <laughs> So barely, I barely made it. <laughs> but then, now I'm also in the category where for tall people that you can punch short people. <laughs> I'm sorry, Sicho. <laughs> okay. That's enough about me. <laughs> Short, older folks, yeah. Let's talk about some stuff I like, and this is probably going to be stuff that I'm going to do on stream later, too. Um, so, yes, I like games. I didn't put anime on here, but yeah, I watched a lot of anime in my time. There's not much to do in the archive once everything was organized, so... Base takes. <laughs> yeah, I could have made this very 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 long but I thought about talking about stuff rather than just listing them out here yeah that's my cat yes you will see her on Twitter sorry no not sorry <laughs> but yeah if you can see here cats oh yeah you like cheesecake too I make I make all kinds of things, but uh, I've made like the the best thing I've made cinnamon cheesecake. So th I call that my specialty. I can make cookies, cakes, uh, and all kinds of stuff. It, basically, I can follow any recipe because I know like the basic skills of being able to bake. So. I might do hand cam streams with baking later, uh, once I get more comfortable streaming. Uh, yeah, let's start with games though. Uh, I love pretty much any type of RPG, especially ones with like great story. Um, I haven't been playing games the last few years as much, so I'm gonna use streaming as an excuse to go back and be able to play games that I've missed out on, like Elder. Uh, like a, uh, like a Elden Ring, and uh, 
Breath of the Wild, stuff like that. Uh, I am behind on. I play. My history of like competitiveness is from like MMOs, like World of Warcraft. I used to be a hardcore raider. Um, in the last like couple expansions, though, I haven't really played a lot, but I really, really want to catch up because I didn't play the last raid at all. And I also play Final Fantasy fourteen. I played Guild Wars, and uh, I usually try out every MMO, but the ones that have stuck is, of course, WoW and um, Final Fantasy fourteen. I haven't finished Final Fantasy XIV yet, though. Yeah, I plan to do WoW Wednesdays. <laughs> I can show you off my collection. I've been playing since I was really young, so... Well... I guess it's relatively young to y'all. <laughs> uh, I also really like Japanese RPGs. Um, I haven't finished very many of them though because it's just time. I really want to play the new uh, Final Fantasy 16, and uh, I want to catch up on like tail series and stuff too. And I also really like um, like what's it called? Like the grim dark type RPGs. I want to try. I've never, like, I've watched a lot, but I want to try playing, like, Elden Ring and, uh, Dark Souls and stuff. Uh, I also really like Grand Strategy, so you can think of, like, Stellaris and, like, building games where you can, like, build cities and stuff and, like, Sim. I like Sims too, but that's not a strategy. I was just like building. Really? <laughs> I like creating and plotting cities and. Yeah. And then, uh, anything with like heavy lore, I'll try out. So, like, I'll show you my schedule later. I'm gonna try to play, like, um, Outer Wilds, the first, for my first long forum stream. Uh, I've listen to people play it a little bit, but I didn't want to get spoiled, so I haven't watched it entirely. And I really want to play it. Also, um, the next one probably going to be like, uh, what's it, Starfield or something? I forgot the name of it. Uh, then on to food and beverages. Yes, I put beverages here. I am a brewer after all. Yeah, I'm really excited for Outer Wilds. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, yes, the first thing on there for food is sweets. I have a sweet tooth. It's a problem. But what? Oh well. I I I'll eat it, almost anything. <laughs> That's sweet. Yeah, it's a problem though. My favorite fruit. Everybody that I've liked so far have hated it. But oh well, it's melon. I really like honeydew melon, it's my favorite. And uh, I can attest to this. If you cut up a honeydew melon and you put it in the fridge for like a day before you eat it, it is so good. <laughs> you gotta like give it time to like ferment a little bit. And then of course, my specialty yeast of creating and enjoying. I am a tea, coffee lover, and yes, I like beer. <laughs> I like ales and stouts the most. Especially red ale, and that's very rare, and I wish I could find it more. It's, there's nothing like uh, after you work, and then you come home, and you open like an ale. And then also, uh, like, it very occasionally, I'll go to Earth and I'll grab a bottle of tequila just to have uh, on like special occasions, occasions and stuff. 
And my favorite kind of tequila drink is like with a uh, fresh squeezed orange and cinnamon. <laughs> what? That's funny. <laughs> yeah, and also this is a thing too. Uh, I hate cold drinks, so yeah. With that beer, you can also drink ales and stouts at room temperature and they're just fine. Yeah, cinnamon is a uh, very good. I like like the fall season too because all the cinnamon like goodies come out, and I just feel like in the winter and fall you can just eat it and it helps like be warm. And then some of the hobbies I do, I really 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 like music, like really. I mean, I'm. I started streaming because I was so interested in like getting more into music. I used to be like first and second chair flute player and band. I I really liked it. And I feel like I've lost a lot of those skills with playing. And I wanna go back to it. So yeah. Uh, you'll be hearing that some. Uh, my music interests. I enjoy classical just because of the nature of my music background. But, uh, I'm really, really into rock music. Especially, like, emo and, uh, heavy, heavy and metal. And I also enjoy just like chilling to lo-fi. And I'm new to Vocaloid music, but there's a lot that I like so far. So yeah, I'm gonna try to learn, be learning to sing too. I've started a few months ago and it's okay. It's going okay. I'm gonna take a little water break. Yeah. If you're interested in my vocal range, I'm an alto, so I'm on the lower end of the female voice. I can get pretty low, so I'm hoping that like someday I can also learn how to scream too. Yeah. <laughs> uh. So I have am I. With the singing, I'm having problems though because my voice is all scratchy and stuff. That's because I'm older and I didn't really start learning to sing earlier. Uh, I also enjoy crafting, so I can knit and sew. So I might do some hand cans of that too later. I want to experiment with that. That might be the like, back burner type streams though. And I, the thing I want to do with y'all, with the community, is writing. So I set up a world anvil for your uh, for y'all to help start writing and uh, to create your own like OC lores and stuff within my world. And with the whole point of the archive at imagery is to share stories and to just relax here and archive your adventures and what you've explored so I want to do that with y'all and I've set up a world anvil web page for us to be able to communicate and write together yeah if you want to write anything uh, I have I can um, work on getting that more set up so just let me know okay i'm also currently uh writing books um i'm still trying to organize everything for lore but for tempest and armis and cj has been helping me with that um we haven't been getting to it though we've been so busy especially me with uh moving and Getting the stream all set up. Streaming. Yeah. <laughs> we hope to make that 
a separate website later too. So we can do a big lore website for all the stars. Yeah, I'm excited to do that. That's, I need to organize my life and then we'll get to that. <laughs> Uh, for writing, though, in the past I've written a lot of stories. I just haven't really shared them on the internet. Uh, I, I'm i really big into world building. I really, really, really like world building. I like creating uh, like creatures and political landscapes and stuff. So I just I really like drama, I guess. Uh, especially in, like, fantasy settings. And then, uh, yeah, of course, uh, baking. I can cook, too, but I prefer baking over cooking. And this is my cat. Her name's Mavis. And Mavis means Song of the Nightingale. So she's a tuxedo kitty, and she likes to sing a lot and talk, so... Yeah. Uh, now, I don't like, not like many things, but, and this is uh, kind of contradictory to my other uh, personas that I take on while I enter like Elysium and stuff. <laughs> so. I don't like strawberries and blueberries. Yeah. Yeah, that's weird. Uh, I, uh... I, uh... Mosquitoes are... I understand why they exist for a certain... Like, as a group. For, like, certain uh, insectivores and stuff. But they can all die. <laughs> yeah. That's a, one of my biggest pet peeves. And I hate when streamers, like, on stream without, like, thinking about it, but I understand why they do it, especially if you're, like, in a longer stream, like, for eight, ten hours, like, stream cons and stuff. But, yeah, I just don't, I can't. I always, like, click off. Do it. Yeah, I'm not a strawberry enjoyer. I don't like the flavor of them. And blueberries too. I'll eat blueberries. They're there, but I don't like them. Also mint. I hate anything mint. Yeah. No mint. No mint ice cream. No mint uh, peppermint patties. Stuff like that. I don't eat that stuff. I don't know why. Just like burns, I guess. I don't like it. But yeah, this is like some of the few things I hate. Also, I think I'm like slightly allergic to mosquitoes, so whenever they bite me, I, it itches really bad. So that's why I hate them. No mint, yeah. <laughs> I don't like. T I actually don't like toothpaste. Like I have to use it because there's like no other flavors for adults. But I really, really just hate toothpaste. It's like a tolerant, like I tolerate it for toothpaste. <laughs> I... Okay. So I want to talk to you about what the archive of imagery is. Uh, and you just entered here. Uh, the door opened, finally. It took me, I don't know how many centuries to get it to work. It, was, it wasn't, it's not my forte, it's a magical property of, tra of transportation and I took me a while. Even with help. Because most of the people here are, uh, not, uh, skilled in teleportation. Yeah. Yeah. I finally reached out past just, like, communication. I am actually able to put up an image of myself for y'all now. And y'all can, uh, um, see the basics of what is here. Hopefully, uh, it will become clearer later for y'all. So, basically what the archive is... 
we're in a separate plane of existence right now. And it's outside time. So, yeah. Make of that what you will. It's basically a giant, uh, galactic greenhouse. <laughs> yeah. And also, it's a, an archive of just imagination, basically. So, I like to archive stories. Other people archive art. Um, and videos and stuff like that. Just, just an archive and expression, basically. Hey. And what are you? Well, unfortunately when you enter here, you don't, it's like, so the archive is a projection of my will. So when you enter here, you kind of take on a different form. <laughs> Of course, once you leave, you go back to your normal self, but for, for wherever you go. Yeah, you can be a red panda. And Alu made this. Alu girl, he made this. Or, I made this. Isn't it cute? You're a little red panda. Yeah, you can be any animal you want to. Uh, like I said, I'm from Clan Vulcans, and that's a red, red panda, so my will kind of makes most people red pandas. <laughs> Little red panda gremlins. But uh, there's other people here that are different animals, so you can choose any animal you like. As long as it can override my will. <laughs> Yeah, you'd be a snail too. I don't know if you can carry a lot, but you can be a hamster. Uh, so just any reflection of the form of your imagination that you leave yourself will be basically. But I'm gonna refer to y'all as the pandemonium because y'all kind of like to cause chaos. <laughs> Thank you for following Silas Blair. Thank you. And then uh, I want to show you myself off to y'all a little bit. Uh, one second. So this is the PNG form. I'll show you a full image later, but I wanted to show y'all like the different uh, what different settings I have so far that I can show. I'm able to show you. So this is me like normal. Uh, I can grab a book. So this one's just about me. I've been kind of writing out like a diary. <laughs> yeah, sorry, I'll show you legs later. <laughs> and then, uh, I can make an angry face when I get mad at you little gremlins. And you cause chaos. And I can do it with a book, so I can book shock you. Yeah. And then, yeah, I can cry. I cry, actually, a lot. <laughs> I cry with my book too. I do. I cry the most with a book. Oh, it's not working. Oh well. Just imagine the book there. That's how I'm going back normal. <laughs> uh, last book that made me cry like really hard. I had to like. I, I was like listening to an audiobook, and I had to stop working in the middle of my old job because. I started crying, and it was um, book five of the Stormlight Archive, because I related to a scene so much. Yeah, books make me cry. Alright. 
And this is uh, my reference sheet. I'll post this to Twitter later and on my Discord as well. Uh, Ruzi made this. And yeah, you can see my legs and my tail finally. <laughs> And then, uh, like, my, uh, my pit, my logo and everything. This little gear and lily. I really like belts, and I like corsets, so I don't have, like, a belt. But I like to have different steampunk outfits, so. Yeah. I, I, I really, really, really like, uh... The steampunk aesthetic. Also, my old world was kind of um, in that era, I guess. But we practiced out a lot of alchemy and magic, so and we uh, had like clock workers and stuff. Yeah, <laughs> I really like my tail. It's so long and fluffy. It makes like a like a a pillow to sleep on when I'm out exploring, so I don't ever have to carry a pillow. And this is all the artists that work on everything. Uh, like I said, I made my own like overlays and stuff, but I, I had to get help for everything else because I'm a, I'm a terrible artist. I, I, have, I don't draw very well, but that's something I want to work on too. Cause I want to be able to draw for like my audiobooks later. Yeah, so my design artist is Ruzi. She's at Rooster Room. She was up here in the chat sometime. Oh yeah, Rooster Sea Flower. And then uh, my PNG artist is Ado. Uh, it created he. They created my uh, form that I'm talking to you in. They did an amazing job. And uh, my background artist, you'll see them later. Uh, you'll see my background here. It was the starting background that I had, but also my starting screen and my ending screens and my beat right back screens. I can go over that real quick. But it's a uh, lovey, lace lovey. And lovey is like, Lovey is a streamer too, and they've made a lot of like uh, art for music videos and stuff as well for other YouTubers. So let me uh, go through the screens real quick. So you saw my starting screen, but here's my be right back screen. And then, see, you little gremlins really, really, really like to try to sneak in everywhere where I am, where I'm at. But, uh, you kind of make Carl mad. <laughs> and then, uh, you saw, and this is my chat screen. So we'll go there for a second. You get to be in my section of the archive. <laughs> yeah. Are they cute? Uh, let's see. I have a desk. So I do a lot of writing here. And then I have a chair. A big, 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 oversized, comfy chair. And then uh, I have a cup that I like to drink out of. Uh, this one. Uh, came from a stream with uh, Brandon <laughs> and he made my this cup for me and I, I just I thought it was funny <laughs> and then I have a projector too so I can uh, uh cups floating sorry <laughs> so whenever I can do like audiobooks and stuff later I plan to uh, have stuff on this projector over here yeah, you like the chair? It, I really like big, 
comfy chairs too. And then, uh, if what are you, is it? oh, it's not. This, sorry, but yeah, y'all are over here <laughs> on this on this easel. Sorry, it wasn't on. Uh, okay. Let's go back to the screen. It's going well. I'm going over time. I thought it was only going to be 30 minutes, so I'm probably going to hit an hour. I'm taking my time for some reason. Uh, <laughs> uh, so, uh, that was all the background. So you'll see the ending screen at the end. Uh, the emotes and alert icons, uh, I don't have emotes yet, but when I do, I'm gonna put the same ones that are on the Discord and alert them. They're so cute, aren't they? Just little pins. You'll see that, you saw the one with the heart earlier, but... Uh, I'm so excited to share those when I can. Sorry, I'm coughing. Uh, I'm so excited to share those when I'm able to. They're so cute. I have different, there's different poses and stuff too. Uh, all the starting music and ending music was worked on very, 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 very much by uh, Rock to Beat Lucas and Rise Illustrious. They like combined their efforts to make that music. And then Dama is my background music, and I have not asked this whole time, but is it too loud or too soft? I tried to put it at a level where it wouldn't be like, too loud, but... Have y'all been hearing it? Okay. Okay. Cool, yo, I did the levels correctly. Um, and then my logo, the one up in the chat screen here, is uh, by Moo Moo Pink, or Moo Moo. I had it done a long time ago. Yeah, they. I actually watched the streams uh, for when Lucas and uh, Rise were working on my in starting and ending music. So. <laughs> I was like in the background in the uh, Discord chatting to Lucas, being like what I wanted and stuff. <laughs> but I'm also really excited for the background music because I'm gonna use that one a lot for my audiobooks. It's like a Celtic, just a like relaxing Celtic vibe, and I really like it. And it also has a, a Japanese flute in it, and that, that made me really excited. <laughs> when they added that. Yeah, it was fun. I had a lot of fun in those streams. Because uh, I don't get to do music theory stuff a lot. It was really uh, fun. Okay. You, all of you go and follow them and appreciate them, okay? Art's one of my passions too. I love looking at art. I love analyzing art, so it's great. Okay, uh, I have some tags, so if you ever want to like draw me or like clip anything or just joke around with me, I have a couple tags. Uh, y'all, uh, I have a tag for y'all, and um, it's called Pandemonium Box, and it's it's based on the Pandora's box because y'all are just chaos. I mean, y'all are just chaos gremlins, <laughs> so. Thank you, Rise. It was it was a lot of fun. Moo moo. <laughs> uh, the live tag is gonna be plain door open. Uh, we can change any of these tags too. I just I didn't I wasn't very creative.
Yeah, I started recording. So, yeah, you can watch the VOD later. Thank you, lovey. Uh oh. Uh, so... Uh, yeah. Uh, I gotta get moderator stuff up soon. Uh, but, uh, my art tag is Ale Illustration. It's, uh, it's Illustration but with Ale. And I also made sure none of these tags were taken, so... <laughs> I got a bot! <laughs> I wanna... I don't know how to... I don't know how to do that. I'll do a little bit later. Uh, clips! <laughs> My clips? Uh, if I ever get clips, I don't know. I'm not that funny, but... I... I kinda wanna joke around with y'all later during, like, gaming streams and stuff. It's gonna be Ale Projector. Uh... Yeah, in the archive, we don't really have, like, TVs, we just have projectors, so... And then... Uh, the meme tag is Pandemonium Chaos, because, yeah, y'all are just chaos. Okay. And then, uh, what I want to plan for streams and for content... Uh, I'm gonna do audio stories, so reading out to y'all, like, bedtime stories on Discord and YouTube. Uh, I'll update the Discord invite link after your stream. Yeah, y'all are silly little guys. And then, uh, I'm games. Probably lots of games. Lots of MMOs. Lots of, uh, story-based games. Um, and then I plan to do some chill chats and learning to draw streams. I want to be able to draw, like, a children's book vibe. So, like... Peter Rabbit and like cute things like that. That's kind of like watercolor and painted. I want to I want to learn how to draw so I can add images to my audiobooks. So we're gonna be working on that while doing like just chatting streams. I also want to do community lore writing, like I was talking about on World Anvil. Uh, I want to get y'all involved in making your own. Personas and stuff in your own stories within the world within the archive and what you explore and stuff uh, I plan to do music later I'm not very good singing yet so karaoke will come later and then uh, I'm gonna do flute practice section after I repair my flute so like a morning flute practice session every week yeah I, I plan not to blast your ears out. <laughs> and then the and more, I plan to do hand cans, probably like try them out with like baking and knitting and stuff. But that's gonna come a lot later. Yeah, I, I'm ready to play again. So that's what my content at, at first is gonna be. And then here's my schedule for next week. I do plan to do read readings to you on Discord on Sunday, if you can come. Uh, I'm gonna try to read Christmas stories, maybe a couple, two or three, like the night before Christmas, stuff like that. And then on, I'm gonna go ahead and stream on uh, Christmas too. I, I don't really have any family plans, so. I want to play the personality game to like talk about more about myself and to share some stories with y'all. Uh, yeah, and then uh, I plan to do a a chatting stream the day after, and we're gonna start drawing for my first audiobook. And then Wow Wednesday, and then uh, my first on every Saturday I plan to do long form streams. And I, the first game I want to play is Outer Wilds. Because I, I really, really, really want to see that story. And this art is by Love You Too. It's also the icon. Oh, I'll go back. 
Okay, it's also the icon on the Discord. It's just a little portrait of us. All together and cuddly. Yeah. And then, um, how to connect to me? Uh, my YouTube is Eelsong the Brewer. I'm Eelsong the Brewer in most places. Yeah. You're so cute. We're so cuddly and cute. You, 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 uh, you've done so much for me and helped me. Love you. Thank you. Also, all my artists helped me so much with streaming and getting everything ready. Edo and Ruzi and Lou and Rise and Lucas. Y'all have helped me so much. It's not even funny. Can't even see that. Oh. And then, um, so YouTube, it's Ale Song the Brewer. I plan to have my first video next week. Up oh, next week, hopefully. Uh, I'm gonna be reading um, a grim fairy tale. And then on uh, Discord, my Discord is called Ale Songs Explorers League. Uh, I don't have any uh, boosts yet, so I don't have a permanent invite link, so I have to update it every week. I'm gonna update it again after the stream, like I said. And then my Twitter is at Brewer Ale Song. Uh, the world anvil you're gonna be looking for is called the archive of imagery. It is not updated yet. I haven't created the home page yet, so it's gonna look very plain right now. And then uh, I have more links to like Instagram and stuff. I've never really used Instagram, but I want to take some IRL pictures, like uh, scenic pictures, eventually to share. And. Uh, to, I have a Patreon link to to uh, get some extras on the Elysium, uh, the Tempest Elysium uh, World Anvil page, so that we can start doing more together there too. What? And then that's it. That's how you can talk to me. Thanks for coming by. Uh, let's go to the chatting screen again. Hey, so uh, I'm glad this actually didn't cut out at all. So we streamed pretty well today. <laughs> I was so afraid because my internet's been acting up, and then we went a lot longer than I thought I would. I'm sorry, I talk a lot. <laughs> um, I just am so excited to start doing something besides being stuck in a lab or just hurting <laughs> but yeah I'm excited to start stuff with y'all thank you for coming by everybody and thank you for the follows and uh, there will be a VOD in this so if you want to go back to the beginning you can um, but I'm kind of embarrassed because I was super nervous at first yeah, they were nice. I, I'm surprised. Only one hiccup. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go and drink a whole bottle of water. Because my throat's all scratchy. <laughs> Thank you for coming by. And, uh, I've been Ailsong the Brewer. A brewer of stories. Coffee. Tea. Beer. And... Anything else you can imagine. See y'all later. Bye-bye.